Salam, Mr. Amir. Alaikum Salam. Thought we said no new faces. Ah. That's my uncle, Mr. Bao. Mr. Amir. Pleasure to meet you. Thank you. Mm. That taste. Nice place. Thank you. Hey, I know you guys probably have your own customs and your way of doing things, but I don't want to be rude. Maybe we can get business out of the way before dinner. I was honored to participate in Beyond Redemption in the sense that uh, it has uh, mostly an all Asian cast, uh, possibly with the exception of myself and, uh, and my sidekicks. Um, I think it's, it's important for me to participate in this kind of work because I have a strong belief in what we see in standard Hollywood films, uh, in standard, in even indie films in North America, they don't really reflect the population that we live in. Um, I think it's kind of a dated perspective of uh, the world around us, and, I, and it's worked its way into our television and our film and our media, uh, and it's just not realistic. And I think more films like this need to be made where we get immersed into a culture uh, other than the predominant Caucasian culture. Um, at the end of the day, what matters is that we have a story to tell, and we're going to get together and tell it to the best of our abilities. Um, the, the race of the characters is a secondary thing to the story itself and to the, to the art that we're trying to make in this movie. And so. Um, the fact that it's a Canadian film with an all-Asian cast and me um, makes it important. It levels the playing field and it creates opportunities for um, non-Caucasian actors, performers, filmmakers uh, to do their thing and to let the world see what they can do.